Back in April 2017, I went for an MRI scan and I was laying on the bed and I heard a clunk and then there was pain. Um, I laid there until the MRI scan finished and I couldn't move, the pain was excruciating. I had to get a taxi home. I spent the whole weekend on the floor in my living room and it was just horrific. I didn't know what was wrong with me. And I ended up calling an ambulance, my son came. I didn't want to go to hospital, went to the, my GP and got prescribed some very strong pain relief. A friend came to visit me. I was so frustrated. I couldn't do anything. I breathed, I was in pain. I sat, I was in pain. I stood, I was in pain. I laid, I was in pain. And I wanted, I wanted to paint, I wanted to do something to relieve it. And my friend said, paint, how are you feeling? And I said, wow, I don't want to do that. So it won't look pretty if I do. And he said, just express how you're feeling. So I did. And what I did was I took three photographs of myself at my lowest point of me, screaming, crying, being miserable. And then I sketched and painted the images. When you look at that painting, it's, it's, it's unfinished because it was captured in a moment. I was in, there's tears, there's anger, there's fear. There's anxiety, there's stress in that painting. So it's pretty raw. And then after seeing it, it was like, wow, I need to see something pretty now. I need to like really paint something beautiful because until I looked at that self-portrait, I didn't realize just how much pain I was in. I just wanted to see you know, more positive images of women of colour because I've got, you know, a lot of black, Asian, mixed race girlfriends and I just wanted images that represented us for once, positive images, you know. I then thought of, you know, black women that inspired me, singers, actresses, you know, inspirational women that I liked, that I'd grew, grown up watching or listening to or dancing to. Nina Simone and Sade. With Nina, I used a different technique because I wanted to represent the textures and layers of paint with the many characteristics of her personality and that shone through in the final result. I used the method from Reflections on the Pebbles for the head wrap because I wanted something different. Portraiture was something I always wanted to do and always steered clear of but this pain enabled me to push through my boundaries and and challenge myself and create the collection and it's such a wonderful collection so i hope you enjoy it as much as i do